<laughs> you guys experience this too. Can you guess where Summer is? The drama queen. Summer! Not you, get over here. Baby, come here. Come here, baby. Summer. Come here. Come on, eat your food now. Summer. Come here. Come on. Summer. Summer. Come here. No. Come here. What is this drama? Come here. Come here. Eat your food. Food now. Food first and then bed. Food now. Come on. Eat your food. Food. Good morning! It's day two. So I am just feeding the girls. This one hasn't eaten. That one has eaten maybe three servings. Last night she got away with like three servings because I served the food for the two of them and then I saw her eating and then Summer was about to go there and I was just so tired so I took a shower while waiting for my um, grab food and when I got back I saw her eating Summer's chair. So. She got three servings. But then again, we have good exercise. We have been having good exercise. Uh, we did, I think, almost 10 kilometers yesterday. I'm hoping to do more today because we have time. So change of plans, we weren't able to do the hike because it was raining this morning. It wasn't safe for the humans as well as the dogs because we do a sunrise hike. So that would mean we would have to be leaving at 4 a.m. and then we'd start hiking at around 4.30 to 5 a.m. to be able to reach the sunrise thing. And I just feel like I, we'd run out of time, not to mention I don't want to get sick. I don't want the dogs to get sick. There's just so much in the city life that has to go on <laughs> without getting sick. So anyway, today we're going to be doing several trails and we're going to have a picnic there. It's basically just really a time to relax with friends, with the dogs, summer, food first. Eat your food now. Oh, look at this girl. Hey, go eat your food. One eternity later. I want to emphasize how important teaching your dogs that the leash is a good thing for them because look at how excited they are when I carry the leash. They know something good is coming and they're not afraid of the leash. See, see, she's waiting for it. That this is not a come here, come here, closer. Okay, here we go. Look at how effortless that is. This one too. <laughs> I'm sorry. I only have one hand. Sorry. So we're officially in the car. <laughs> I'm sorry. It's so hard to shoot when you're alone. So, and then I have two dogs. I know I keep making excuses, but but seriously, for those of you who have two dogs, comment down below and agree with me. It's harder to manage, and like if you're gonna take videos and stuff, it's so much harder when you have dogs let alone two, even if you know they're so small and supposedly easier to manage. But yeah, this is our setup. I already booked, I mean, I marked it on ways. We're on our way there. We're gonna meet them there and let's go have fun. Have arrived. Morning. For those of you who are curious how I keep my car clean, so I have my Burks or whatever slippers that you have, which I use for driving, and then I have this bag with my hiking stuff that I just change after so that, you know, when we walk around and it's dirty and I just have to change here and then put it back here so all the dirty stuff will be contained in this bag and it will not stay in the car and then I'll wear this for driving. Clever, right? Today's a pretty chill day. We're just gonna be spending time with Kira and his parents. So the first thing we're gonna do is go to the picnic trails with the dogs and maybe have some spend some time to chit chat before we go to the trails.
One hour later. Phew, so we're finally out of trail one. We actually didn't finish the whole trail because it wasn't safe. So because of the pandemic, I think they didn't maintain the tra trails as much. Like there are a lot of bridges and the bridges are broken. So not only was it wet because it, it rained this morning, and the bridges were also broken. So we had to turn back and go back the same way. And now we're proceeding with the second trail and the third trail. So these two trails are actually connected with each other. I think most of the trails here in Camp Jonte are all connected. So this is a combination of the yellow trail and as well as something like the forest bathing trail. So if you guys are interested in trails like these or like nature, the forest and everything, then this video is for you. This is going to be a montage of the scenery that you will see. It's absolutely beautiful, breathtaking and relaxing so yeah it's my way of unwinding from the busy city life here we go They're dead. My dog is dead. I feel like I abused them. <laughs> or I think they think I abused them. Well, Summer did. Bailey had fun, right? Hey, Bay, you're still ready for another adventure? No? No? Okay. So we're gonna go home now. I'm super tired. Uh, we did two, three trails today. So yeah, definitely tired. I can't wait to order food. Uh, we decided to call it quits. It's around 5 p.m. right now because it's gonna be traffic going home. Otherwise, we're gonna reach the rush hour. My poor dogs. Everyone's <laughs> full of beer.
they're really dead. They're so tired. A tired dog is a good dog. <laughs> We're on our way home now. 